Hello everyone. As we all know that CBS has newly introduced bits in our board exam. So let's now discuss some MCQs from the chapter matrices. Now, first question. The matrix A is equal to 0, 0, 5, 0, 5, 0, 5, 0, 0. Is a dash matrix. Option A, square matrix. Option B, diagonal matrix. Option C, unit matrix. Option D, none of this. As you all know that a square matrix is a matrix in which number of rows is equal to number of columns. And here A is a square matrix. But it's not a diagonal matrix because the non-diagonal elements are not equal to zero. Therefore, it's not the diagonal matrix. And it's not a unit matrix also. So the answer is option A, square matrix. Let's go to the second question. The matrix B is equal to 3, 0, 0, 0, 3, 0, 0, 0, 0, 3 is dash. Option A, 3i. Option B, diagonal matrix. Option C, both A and B. Option D, none. As we all know that, it's in the form of 3i. So it's option A. And it's also a diagonal matrix. Therefore, it's option C, both A and B. Now let's go to the third question. Total number of possible matrices of order 3 by 3 with each entry 2 or 0 are Option A, 5 and 2 Option B, 9 Option C, 27 and Option D, 81 We know that the formula for this is number of terms power order Now, number of terms are 2 or 0 That means 2 power 3 by 3 2 power 9 This goes to 5, 1, 2 So, the correct answer is Option A 5 and 2. Now, next question. The matrix 2x plus y, 4x, 5x minus 7, 4x is equals to 7, 7y minus 13, y, x plus 7. Then, the value of x plus y is dash. Now, from this, let's take two equations. 4x is equals to x plus 7 and 5x minus 7 is equals to y. 4x equals to x plus 7. 5x equals to 5x minus 7 is equals to y. Now, fr from this equation, we get x equals to uh, 6 by 3. It's equals to 2. And uh, 5 into 2. 10 minus 7 is equals to y. y equals to 3. Now, x plus y equals to 2 plus 3. That is 5. Now, next next question. If matrix A is equals to A i j power uh, 2 by 2, where i j A i j equals to 1, if i not equals to and A i j equals to 0, if i equals to j, then a square equals to dash. Option A, 1, i i, option B, A, option C, 0, option D, none. From, from this condition, we get the matrix equals to 0, 1, 1, 0. Now, now, by squaring this, 0, 1, 1, 0. By multiplying this, we get 1, 0, 0, 1. It is an identity matrix. So, the correct option is option A, I. Now, let's go to the next question. If A is equal to 1 by pi, sin inverse x pi, tan inverse x by pi, sin inverse pi x by pi, cot pi x, B is equal to 1 by pi minus cos inverse pi x, tan inverse x by pi, sin inverse x by pi, minus tan inverse x pi, then A minus B equals to what? Option A, I. Option B, 0. Option C, 2, I. Option D, half I. Now, let's calculate it. A minus B equals to 1 by pi into sin inverse x pi plus cos inverse x pi tan inverse x by pi minus tan inverse x by pi sin inverse x by pi minus sin inverse x by pi cot inverse x pi plus tan inverse x pi. Now, here, sin inverse x by pi and minus sin inverse x by pi cancel out and tan inverse x by pi minus tan inverse x by pi also cancel out. 
Now we know that sin was a plus cos was b is equals to pi by 2. And cot was a plus tan was a is equals to pi by 2. So we get 1 by pi into pi by 2, 0, 0, pi by 2. Now taking pi by 2 common, we get 1 by pi into pi by 2 into 1, 0, 0, 1. Here pi pi cancel and we get half and this is i. So the correct option is half i. Moving on to the next question. If a and b are two matrices of order 3 by m and 3 by n and m equals to n, then the order of matrix 5a minus 2b is option a 3 by m, option b 3 by n, option c both a and b, option d none. We know that if m equals to n, then 5a minus 2b is either of order 3 by m or either of order 3 by n. So it can be both a and b. Now, next question. If a is equals to 0, 1, 1, 0, then a power 2020 uh, 20 is what? Now, let's find a square first. a square equals to 0, 1, 1, 0 into 0, 1, 1, 0. By multiplying this, we get 1, 0, 0, 1. It's an identity matrix. We know that identity matrix power anything is identity matrix. So, the correct answer is option A and both option C. So, option D, both A and C. Now, next question. The matrix 1, 0, 0, 0, 2, 0, 0, 0, 4 is a dash matrix. Option A, identity matrix. Option B, symmetric matrix. Option C, Q symmetric matrix. Option D, none of this. First, ver let's verify the options. It's not an identity matrix. It's a symmetric matrix because A transpose equals to A. It's not a Q symmetric matrix because A transpose is not equal to minus A. So the correct answer is symmetric. Now let's hear an important note. All diagonal matrices are symmetric matrices. Now let's go to the last question of our session. If A is a matrix of order M by N and B is a matrix such that A, B dash and B dash A are both defined, then order of matrix B is option A, M by M, option B, N by N, option C, N by M, and option D, M by N. Now let's, uh, let's see the answer. Given that A is of order M by N, Let's assume B is of order P by Q. Given that A, B dash and B dash A are both defined. So, and the order of B dash equals to Q by P. Now, in the A, B dash, M by N into Q by P. Here, this both must be equal. So, N equals to Q. In B dash A, M by, sorry, Q by P and M by M. P and M must be equal. So, P is equal to M. The order of B is P by Q, which is M by N. So the correct option is option D, N by N.